Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am in the mood of crafting and I'm going to show you three quick DIYs and these are going to be floral arrangements for home decor and all of these items here are from your local Dollar Tree. Um, spring is around the corner so we need to get ready for um, our barbecue decors and I think these uh, cute floral arrangements would be great for that so I can't wait to show you and the main focal point of these three DIYs is this vase so we're gonna decorate this vase slightly in different ways and just give it a different feel so I hope I make sense anyways are you guys ready let's get started Okay, so for the first floral arrangement, we are going to need our glue gun, green moss, this cute squared vase, a headband, and they had really cute headbands, different options, and this is the one I got. That's the name. Some foam balls. You're actually going to need one. And the beautiful flowers, and these have like this cute pink tone color and this is the name in case you get want to get the same one okay first thing we want to do we're going to take one of these foam balls which is right here we are going to glue this inside here take our glue gun add a fair amount and we are going to glue it down here and just give it a minute for it to dry on the meantime, I am going to snip my flowers. You can use your scissors, but I decided to purchase one of these. It makes it so much easier. And these are like wire cutters, which is so cool. But it's not necessary. You can use your scissors. Or also you can bend them. Okay, so we have our flowers. This should be dry now. Okay, so now we can start placing our flowers. I like to place one in the center and then I go from there. I go around. And you want to give it like different heights. Maybe one kind of like bent slightly like this. I think this one is two. There we go. Okay. So now that we have our flowers, I'm going to bring you guys up a little bit. I'm going to take my green moss. And we are going to put it in here, like so. This can get a little bit messy. Okay. All right, so now I have our green moss in place, and that kind of hides the uh, foam ball. Now we're going to take our headband and this would give it the final touch. It's going to make it um, very country style. Love this lace. It kind of has a shimmer. And so what we're going to do is remove this piece here because that's not needed. Okay, and we're going to remove the other end as well. And we should have something like this. And this is going to go around the vase. So I'm going to start gluing from the back. Just a little bit of glue to keep that in place. We are going to bring the other end pulling slightly. And we are going to add a little more glue. And 
and then we just cut the excess off and we are done there is our cute floral arrangement all right you guys so for the second floral arrangement we are going to need the squared vase another headband and again these are from the Dollar Tree and they are so pretty they had tons of options and it's just a head wrap and I got this um, it's not a flower but it is a cattail and it is in purple I thought it would go very well with this um, gray bow and we're also going to need the white stones so this is going to be super simple and we're going to start with the headband. We're going to take this headband and we're going to cut off this piece, the ends, just like we did on the other one. And I'm hoping, and this is going to be wrapped around, just want to make sure I have enough. And I do. Okay. Okay, so now we are going to take our glue gun, add a little bit of glue on the back of the vase, bring this back, add some more glue. Okay, it's looking cute already, but I feel like um, it needs some white, and that's where the stones come in. You're just going to add the stones. It looks even better with the stones right and now we are going to take our cattail let me cut this piece off and this bundle is going to be inserted right in the center And we are done for the third DIY we are going to need these white stones a succulent the vase and I found these awesome temporary tattoos and look at the colors so this one is going to be super colorful which I really like okay so the first thing we want to do is cut the piece that you're gonna place onto your vase and the goal is to have it right in the center Okay, so this comes with a film. You're gonna remove that film. We are then going to place it, like we said, right in the center of the vase. We are going to take a damp cloth and we are going to rub it for like 30 seconds make sure it's like fully wet and why don't we leave this there for a few more seconds make sure it's wet okay and let's see what happens when you remove this excellent so this is what you should have cute right so I'm gonna um, do a few more and then I will come back to show you alright you guys so I think it turned out really cool look at the colors isn't it cute and if you want once it's completely dry you can use some Mod Podge and seal it alright so the next step on this is to add some white stone And finally, we are going to take our succulent and place it right in the center. 
country style or shabby chic. Hmm, let's just call it elegance. It is super easy to make and overall cost was only $5. Throw in a bow and some cattail and oh my god, cuteness overload. Overall cost was only $4. And can we talk about these body tattoos for a minute? I mean, look at the colors, they are absolutely beautiful. Overall cost was only $4. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at ablee25, double L, double E. And don't forget that you and I have an appointment in my next video. Bye-bye.